All right, guys, uh, just bringing you to a net poll, uh, the network for police monitoring. Um, it's a bunch of solicitors that uh, seem, I think they do pro bono work, so it's free, uh, uh, giving advice and uh, giving uh, information to the media, uh, just discussing issues. Um, and I'm going to leave a report down here, which is, uh, as you can see there, it says report to policing. Uh, and basically, um, now I sent an email to that email address, um, info at netpol.org. Uh, and I've had no reply, as I was saying in my earlier videos. Um, so as we scroll down on this one, uh, I'll just do that. So they're basically uh, just talking about various issues that they've got. Um, there is a spot here somewhere where they're talking about uh, domestic extremist database. Uh, they're saying the police uh, run it, though, uh, although it isn't actually the police. Uh, they do finish off the uh, thing saying on the domestic extremist units lack any real accountability or transparency and ultimately lacks any credibility. It is a shadowy unit that has been allowed to set its own rules for spying on legitimate political activity and dissent and has no place within British society or British policing. Of course, it isn't actually British policing. It's, it, you know, the, if you go onto the MI5 website, they now have the domestic extremist database uh, listed on there, or it was, um, so uh, a few weeks ago. So anyway. That's that. So I've contacted them, and um, to be honest with you, I wasn't getting a reply. I thought, you know, I, I really should phone them up just just to just to confirm, if you like. Um, so if I was to, where, where's their phone got number gone? Uh, right, contact. Click on contact. Uh, solicitors. All right, let's try contact again. Oh, well. I'm over here trying to get onto contact. Now, they give you two options here, media and report policing, but last time I just clicked this contact and I got a phone number around about there. So, what's going on? All right, media. Click on media. Click on media. All right, now here we go very slow for some reason anyway well <clears throat> while I'm waiting for this to boot up um, in fact actually I'm gonna, gonna hit report see if that comes through quicker uh, okay that's not working uh, right, I've clicked on contact no. right so it's transferring from netpol.org It doesn't seem to be transferring much. <clears throat> this, while that's going on, uh, we can let me see. Quickly check out. Oh, rad safe. See if that I can get back on that. Oh yeah, no, it's working fine. Uh, <laughs> transferring data from Netpol. Uh, let's try another site. Um, Whistleblower exposes World Bank corruption. That's a, that was a good story. Uh, <clears throat> right, so if I want to, let's just go Australian Tea Party. Yeah, that works. Oh, a bit. Okay, oh, there's a lot of pictures on that one, but it shouldn't have taken that long to load. But we'll go back to Netpol. Transferring data from netpol.org. <laughs> Let's try about. Is it the whole website they're messing around with now? Yeah, I can't can't get onto anything. Hang on, let's try some other links. Uh, Guardian from the Netpol site. So we're going out of the Netpol site. Transferring data from Netpol. All right, um, um, uh, what else then? So I'm, I'm just trying to show you what the hell's going on here. Uh, 
Okay, well, <clears throat> anyway, so what I did, what I cleverly did, is I wrote down the number, <laughs> which is, I don't know if you'll be able to see it, is there, and it's 07873122402, just in case you can't see it. Uh, and I did give it a call, and um, this number is unavailable. Please try again later. That's interesting, isn't it? Still transferring data from Netpol. This was working when I first came onto it, this this website. I could click on that, I could click on that, I could click on anything and I'd get it. Uh, okay, well, anyway, so uh, you can see the sort of kind of shenanigans I'm having to put up with here. Netpol site, you're being hacked and you've got no address so people can't turn up uh, and you've got no physical address so people can't send a letter. Uh, which would have been a good idea in this disgusting day and age, wouldn't it? Um, <clears throat> so, uh, so where are you? Where are you? I can't even get around your website now. Members. Oh. Okay. Well, anyway, so um, I'm just going to leave this one for now and I'm going to have a a little bit more ago. Uh, just as a side issue, the LLRC, the Low Level Radiation Campaign website, um, basically they've just found out that their emails, their outgoing emails, um, have been uh, 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 stopped basically. So if they've been sending emails out to anyone, if somebody's asked them a question on the LLRC website and not received a reply, um, <clears throat> it's not because uh, Richard Brammel is. Uh, is, uh, you know, he doesn't like them. <clears throat> it's basically because Richard Bramble did reply and you never got a response. Um, he's now using Gmail, but we're not sure if that's uh, too clever. I, I went to send him an email on Gmail in return last night and uh, the email, uh, well, it just didn't work. Um, I've got problems now with my password on, on Gmail. Um, very odd. Anyway, so um, I'm, I've been messing around trying to sort that out today. Um, uh, but that's just another thing to uh, mention to you guys. Um, uh, so basically, yeah, yeah, the LLRC website, if you've been contacting it, um, has uh, has not been able to respond to you. Um, he's he's uh, got a Gmail address, uh, and I'll I'll um, I think I'll leave that underneath the. Uh, uh, the video here that I'm going to put up and I would say that um, <coughs> that, that there's no relying on that getting there because it's Gmail, Google, uh, Prism. So um, anyway, I, I, I've also got the uh, riseup.net um, email um, and apparently that stopped on some servers, uh, although most servers accept the email, some, some put a block on it. Um, I think uh, that'll, that, that'll cover it for now. Netpol, uncontactable. Um, Netpol.org, about them. Oh, what have we got here? I'm just pressing it again to see if, if it was a glitch. And it's just totally blocked. Okay, but there is a phone number there. You have it now. I have it, uh, but you can't get through on it. Okay, um, and if you're, you're out there, Netpol, uh, you've been hacked and stacked like the rest of us.